Hello, Jim Towns in here again. <clears throat> Today I'd like to uh, show you uh, a method that I call the Townsend method of short multiplication. I love mathematics and a while ago I was playing with an application that I wrote in Datamorph um, to teach my daughter how to use a slide rule program and I in inadvertently uh, happened across a, a really neat way to uh, multiply uh, numbers. Uh, you can get more information uh, about my uh, application. Uh, my website is townsend.b. If you'd like to uh, email me, my number is jim at townsend.b. And this is the Townsend method of short multiplication. I've recently uh, written a book on the subject. It's called The Neat Way to uh, Multiply Numbers. I'm selling this book for $10. And um, you can uh, buy it online by contacting me at uh, jim at townsend.b just send me an email or go to townsend.b and make a ten dollar donation and just write into the uh, memo that you'd like me uh, that you'd like for me to send you my application called the neat way to multiply numbers okay the neat way to multiply numbers <coughs> that I call short division it's really very easy to do what it is is you have a matrix of numbers okay so, say if I want to um, uh, multiply um, out the uh, number, say, um, 79 times 95, okay? So, I write 79 down the side of the grid, 95 over the top of the grid, okay? Just like that, okay? Then I can say 7 times 9 is 63, 7 times 5 is 35, 9 times 9 is 81, and 9 times 5 is 45. And then what I end up with is a grid like this. However, now what you have to do with this grid is um, add it up across. Okay? Actually, you've got to add it up across this way in order to um, figure out uh, what the, the sum is. So if you write it in a little bit of a different fashion, Okay, so I can make an X on a 45 and then just put uh, uh, two crosses like that. And then I'm going to write the same thing on an angle instead. Okay, 79 times 95. You see how I did it on the bottom there? Okay, so now what I can do is 7 times 9 is 63. 7 times 5 is 35. 9 times 9 is 81. And nine, and 9 times 5 is 45. <clears throat> and you end up with the numbers like this instead. Okay, now you can see that what you can do is you can simply add up the numbers in a column in order to get your sum. So it would be 5, 0, carry over the um, 1, 9, 6 is 5, 7. So your answer is 7505. 79 times 95 is 7505. So anytime that uh, uh, that you uh, need to uh, make a quick calculation, again, all you have to do is to make an get this piece of paper over here. Make an X on your piece of paper, okay? Then you can just draw two little lines up like that. Say if we want to multiply 89 times 95, okay? 9 times 8 is 72. 8 times 5 is 40. 9 times 9 is 81. 9 times 5 is 45. Okay, so then we have 5, add in the columns, 5, and add up the columns, 4, 8. 84, 55 is the answer to 89 times 95. So it's really very easy to um, use this method. Say uh, if you wanted to... Uh, if you're in the store and you have uh, um, six items that you want to uh, buy, and those uh, uh, six items are 14.95 each, you can dispense all together with the numbers and just write it out like that. See how I wrote six times 14.95? So then what I can do is I can say six times one is zero six. Now there's the key. Always use two numbers when you do it. Six times four is 24. Six times nine is 54 and then 6 times 5 is 30 and so notice how that I wrote the numbers in this method going up there and then all I have to do is just add up the numbers 0, 7, 9, 8 so 6 times 1495 is 8970 very easy to do a uh, quick calculation 
Now, an interesting thing that uh, um, you can do whenever you're um, trying to do two-digit numbers in your head, say if you're trying to uh, uh, multiply 27 times 95, well, that's an awful lot to uh, hold into your head. So what you can do is uh, multiply 2 times 95 and 7 times 95. And then what you do is you put the two numbers uh, uh, together. But you got to remember, it's not really 2 times 95. It's 20 times 95. So you put a 0 on the end, and then you put the two numbers together in a column, and you add them up, and you've uh, got your answer. So now what I'd like to do is to show you how I um, use the little grid on the back of the book in order to um, uh, do multiplication uh, questions. And I'm going to try to hold this uh, um, thing in the way here so that you can see what it is that I'm doing. And I really can't, so I hope that uh, I'm going to get this thing right online. OK, so again, if I want to uh, multiply, say, 69 times uh, 85, uh, 6 times 8 is 48. 6 times 5 is 30. 9 times 8 is 72. 9 times 5 is 45. And then you just add in the columns. 5, 6, 8, 5. 69 times 85 is 5865. Okay, so now I'd like to show you my little um, uh, genie um, program here. What I've done is I've set my um, program to uh, multiply two digit numbers. I set the timer for 15 seconds, so um, it's going to give me 15 seconds in order to um, uh, answer uh, the question. I've got a little um, talking genie in the program. Hello. Now may I help you? So this little guy, he Let sits the there and um, asks you questions, ads. right? Click on the animation menu to find out more about me and to see how Datamorph works. Okay, there he's done talking for a second. So um, I programmed this little guy. Actually, I went to sleep at night just doing up to the nine times tables because you'll realize that if you know up to the nine times tables, that's all you really need to know because uh, that's all you ever use um, using this uh, method of multiplication. And you can use it anywhere. Batteries or lights go out or whatever, and uh, you're still uh, uh, armed and able to do uh, short multiplication uh, really easily. Okay, so I'm going to start this little guy going, and then I'm going to show you that I can sit here and, uh, um, and answer these questions within um, 15 seconds. So if I start the timer on there. Right left well, sir. Okay. And then I'm going to sit here and do this while he asks me some questions. Okay, he's going to ask me some questions here. 43 times 93 equals... 43 times 93, 4 times 9 equals 36, 12, 27, 0, 9, 9, 9, uh, 9, 39, 96. 39, 99. 39, 99. Can't see without my glasses here. 55 times 62 equals... 62, 30... 10, 30, 10, 0, 1, 4, 34, 10. Thirty-four, ten. Fifty-three times sixty-six equals. Fifty-three times sixty-six. Thirty, thirty, eighteen, eighteen, eight, nine, four. 3498. 3498. Fifty-two oh eight. Thirty-nine times sixty-one equals. Sixty-one eighteen three. Twenty-three seventy-nine. Twenty-three seventy-nine. 
Well, there you go. I hope I've uh, piqued your uh, interest in uh, my uh, new uh, method for uh, short multiplication. If you have uh, any more questions, please feel free to uh, um, email me at jim at townsend.b. And um, here's uh, that contact information, jim at townsend.b. Ask me about the Townsend method for um, short multiplication. And... Um, I will uh, give you um, discounts if you uh, want to order uh, multiple books uh, for your classroom or something like that. I'd love to talk to you. Take care, y'all. Love and light. Blessings.